Don't touch it. How many times have my father and I ever warned you not to get close to that sword? A stubborn fly will ever find itself in the grave of the dead. Zeta. The fact that the teeth and the tongue live in the same house in peace doesn't mean that the tongue cannot be punished by the teeth if it talks itself into trouble. Zite, why did you violate my orders? Father! I am not your father! Answer the question. I, I did not. Your Majesty, I did not violate your orders. Liar! I saw you when you tried. Let her speak. I... I was at the verge of doing so when the prince called me to order. Oh, you were about doing so. Mm. The prince has lessened your punishment. Instead of beheading you, you are going to spend three days without food and water. You will spend Three night, after which you will learn how to obey orders. Your Majesty, please temper justice with mercy. I beg you, please. Your Majesty, Your Majesty, please. Your Majesty, she's only but a child. I have spoken. Oma. Yes, Your Majesty. You alone come and see me. Prison and felon is a virtue of one who doesn't dream big. A tree and the farmland that is not useful can be cut off. Death is the penalty of insubordination. Your Majesty, you're talking in parables. It is only the wise that can dance melody life. Why did you betray me? Your Majesty, I can never betray you. You are the oldest servant in this palace. You served my father, my brother, and now you are serving me because I trusted you. Why did you do it? Jesse, I don't know what you are talking about. I am talking about that which can chase the lion into a lie if it is revealed. Oh. Your Majesty, I swear by the graves of my ancestors. I have never told anyone. I swear. I swear I didn't tell anyone. It better be. If I find out to the contrary, of what you have just told me. I will cut your body into shred and feed your carcass to the vulture. As your majesty pleases. Her punishment starts tonight. This is what you should be doing to keep fit. Ziti, you and I know that you are a brave woman. Who am I to be compared to the kind of courage and hard working you've been doing in this palace? Strength 
is not of the physical, but of the mind. You win and lose battle from your inner mind. Mother, how are you doing? Ziti, what of a child are you? You're not shaking my afraid of the unknown. You almost put me to trouble that singular act. Trouble is a routine we need to go through in life to be thought. It either makes you or marry you. I don't even know what to do with you. Whether to pity you or to scold you. Do not pity me. For sympathy is of the weak. I promise you will not be involved in it again. Please, I beg you. Please abide by the rules guiding this palace. I've heard you. Let me go and continue with what I was doing. Mother, is there anything to eat? Oh. I thought you are the cause that will not eat any. I'm hungry. Can you stay two days without food? And you stayed several without food. Son, stop pissing around and sit. Father, did I hear you say sit? Yes. Sit down. She's only a girl. I have been to wars. I have seen where the weakest turned out to be the strongest. I cannot sit and watch a meal that will destroy us being cooked. Calm your nerves. Hmm? Calm your nerves. Have you forgotten we are immortals? That is all I'm trying to say here. Let's make haste while the sun shines. I assure you nothing will happen. If I give you opportunity to suggest, what will you have me do? Here. My friends, <laughs> we are actually doing a practice. So come and try. This is madness. Are you out of your mind? Huh? My friends, it's a game. No one will get hurt. Rather, it will make you perfect and better in the battlefield. I can see you're truly out of your mind. How can a commoner dine and train with? A royalty. Have you washed your dishes in the kitchen? Yes, I've washed my dishes. And filled the pot with water? No, my prince, I... That, that is what you oh, said. My prince, oh, it's not what you said. Oh, oh. Put, put the pot of water in place. I see for her. I wonder what she has done to deserve this heat treatment from them. Before your head will be used for sacrifice. Sacrifice? And you think that I'm scared of it? I would rather die of this rot of the king than to hide the truth. What are you even feeling like? If you know a lover boy, see, listen, I'm part of here. You better keep your apologies. I still love my life. <laughs>
What are you smiling at, you fool? My prince, why do you hate me so much? And why have you chosen to seize every opportunity to rain insult on me? Because you're a fool who doesn't know that you're human. For crying out loud, my prince, you are my brother. May the gods forbid. I can never be a brother to a fool who doesn't behave like a woman. Your conduct irritates me. Now tell me, what were you smiling at? My prince. Don't patronize me. Are you normal? Smiling at an empty throne? Or to a king who is seated there in the spirit? Enough! I overheard Omar lamenting that there's no firewood. He ought to be in the forest fetching some firewood. But you know, no one goes into the forest today. It's a sacred day. It's a direct order from the king. And if you wish, don't go. Stay here and expect the wrath from the king. My prince, why have you chosen to deprive me of my happiness? Why? Why? May the gods answer that for you, fool. Life is misery. today not really my prince why actually my prince she just left to the forest to get firewood <laughs> when last have you had a sumptuous meal <laughs> if I can recall my prince it's been long Today, you shall all eat in plenty. You shall taste the meal you've never tasted before. You know why? Because I, the prince of Anjari Kingdom, is in a happy mood. <laughs> now go. Go to the farm and kill the fattest goat. Go to the yam burns and take the fattest yam. Tell Oma to prepare pepper soup and yam to your satisfaction. <laughs> uh, um, thank you, my prince. Thank you, my prince. Uh, but she is yet to return with the firewood. I cannot wait for her. Thank you, my prince. Thank you, my prince.
can he request for a huge meal? Well, he knows full well that the firewood fetched four days ago disappeared in the twinkle of the eyes. Moreover, Zita is yet to come back. Oma, here are some firewoods. I will get some later. Where is it? She's not back. Where? The priest tucked them up in a store he built for himself. What? How is that possible? Prince, they were attacked by warriors from Ada. Warriors from Ada? Yes, my prince. They even managed to escape. Father, the puppy we are taming to a loyal dog has turned to a lion. Oh. Mm. So. <clears throat> you have to chew the color not smoothly to enable it pass through the throat of an elder. We are no longer safe in this kingdom, Father. What scares the son of a lion? It is Zete. I feel she's affiliated with the guards. Why did you say such a thing? The men I sent to eliminate her came back with bruises. On a normal day, how could a lucky looking maiden like Zete beat up two hefty men to a pulp? You know that to say the, the bruises that they came back with. It was like they encountered a hoof of the wildebeest. This is serious. I'm afraid of the unknown, Father. How do we eliminate her entirely from the palace? Not only out of the palace, it is totally out of the entire kingdom. You have to give me some time to think of something meaningful. Father, we need to act fast.
Zito, you're welcome. Thank you. Has the king arrived? No. Go call all the maidens. Let's start preparing meal. I'm sorry, Zite. The king... I have relieved them of their duties. Father, why? No one questions my authority. But if you wish to know, we cannot afford to pay and feed much mouth in this palace. How about Omar? She is still with us. But Father, it's strange to have the palace without the maidens. This is how I've chosen to run the affairs of this palace. No one dares to change. How did she take the news? She has no choice. You needed to see the look on her face when I broke the news. I could sense the questions running around her mind. Hmm. I pray this method works out. Mm, don't bother my son. She has no any other option than to leave this kingdom. Father, my son, I must confess, you're a genius. <laughs> yes, you must believe in your father. <laughs> uh, Life is misery for you, faith is never fair. Faith is never fair when you all call. In a cold race, more stronger than you all struggles. Swim with fear. Greetings, my friends. You had better finish that thing and take the pot to the stream and fetch some more water. I've done that already. I've also made breakfast for everyone in the palace. If I were not around when she was born, I would have said she is the gods herself. Is there anything the matter? No.
what troubles the lions call. Guards? Yeah. What is it, my son? Father. Have you noticed the condition of the palace? No. What is the condition? Take a look around you. I see nothing. Indeed. We'll all look or see differently. If you have seen what is an eyesore to the kingdom, please speak up. Father, it's been 14 days since you eased the maidens of their duties. Yet, the palace looks like you employ more maidens in addition to the one you had. How do you mean? Haven't you noticed it? You get everything at your disposal. Your clothes, washed. Meals, cooked on time. And to crown it all, the palace is looking more clean than ever. Mm. That is true. Did you employ more maidens? Of course not, father. Is the handwork of Ziti. And the truth is, she does all her chores with our pleasure. We need a change of plan. This plan isn't working. Relax. It is just 14 market days, and you are complaining. Like to say, make haze while the sun shines. Your Majesty. Amma. Yes, Your Majesty. Sit down. I want you to tell me what I need to know. Your Majesty, I don't understand what you mean if I am for you. Are you against me or for me? Majesty, pardon me. I don't know why you ask it, but I am for you. <laughs> Can I trust you? You can always trust me, my king. I want you to take over cooking tomorrow. Your Majesty, why? Is it not doing it very well? She cooks very well. But I want the meal to look extraordinary. No problem, Your Majesty. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty, that is a belief. I want you to squeeze it into half. Your Majesty, this is poisonous. Who do you want to kill? Who else but Zita? That was why I mentioned trust. Will you do it or not?
Mother, you look worried. What is it? My daughter, you are correct. I am worried because I am not happy. I don't like the way they treat you in this palace. You worry too much, mother. I am not bothered. Because they are training me on how to become a good wife in future. And besides, I don't see anything for a woman to be hard working. Ziti, you are far from what I mean. What are you suggesting I do? Ziti, run away. Run as far and fast as your legs can carry you. Why? Why should I run away from my kingdom? Besides, running away is a sign of insubordination to the rulership of the king. But then why? See, I don't like the humiliation they are putting you through. They are humiliating you. Go away. I am the one humiliated. I am not complaining. Or, oh, is there anything you are not telling me? No, not at all. Nothing. <laughs> no, no problem. Then I should get back to work because soon the king and the prince will soon arrive. You don't worry. No, no, I am making the meal today. Why? Don't bother me. Only the gods of this land know why you're doing this training. Mother, there mustn't be a war. I mean, mom must not be a warrior to keep fit. So keep them fit. No problem. So come and carry your food. It's ready. My food? Yes. <gasps> Here. Food. 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 I made it just for you. The best meal I've ever had. <laughs> Mother, come and join me. No, go ahead and enjoy your meal. I'll eat later. 
Finally, the little troubled tiger has been put to rest. Yes, let us think of how to dispose her. Certainly, but let me be doubly sure. Sorry, Your Majesty. I must have slept for long. What is the meaning of this? Eh? Who is a slave you kept to pack up the things you use in eating? I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I had a tedious training today and I passed out. I'll pack it. Sorry. Sorry, my friend. I told you that woman can never be trusted. Oma, oh, but if I am true with you, you will learn to obey instructions. Father, waste no time in beheading that woman.
Hurry up, go inside and pack our things. Who is chasing you? The king wants us dead. Hey. Just go, I will explain to you on our way out. Hurry up, hurry up. Let me look out for the guards. Let me look out for them. Let me look out for the guards. Let me look out for them. Oh, hurry up, Oja, hurry up. Oja, hurry up. Oja, Oja, hurry up. I'm looking out for the guards. Just hurry. Pack your places. Don't leave anything. Just bring the ones in can. Just hurry, hurry. Oh, please. Calm down, calm down. Listen, we are here to help you. Kill you? Is that what you actually think of us? That we can kill you? No! We can do that to a woman who has been taking good care of us as our own children. Yes, the king asked us to return with you or with your head. But we cannot do that. You need to run far away from this kingdom and never to return. And you need to do that fast. Hurry, let's show you an escape route. It's alright. Go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Wait. I told you, Father. I told you. That woman is smarter than what we thought. How do you mean she is nowhere to be found? Before we could get to her house, she have escaped. What do you mean she escaped? What about her daughter? Your Highness, she's still nowhere to be found too. Search every nook and cranny. Turn every scrupy little face upside down. Now, go and search for them. We have done that, Your Majesty. She still knows where to be found. You are unfit to be in a girl. Search again. Go! Get to work. Yes, Your Highness. Another perform the act. Not even your son should try. Else you will have the guards to contend with. You will lose, you will your, lose rights your rights to right your right 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 right
I know you feel threatened. But I assure you she has no knowledge of its importance. How can you say she's ignorant? Yet, she keeps heading to that direction. Destiny. Yes, destiny. How can her destiny tied to my success? Her destiny was not tied to your success until you did what you did. I told you that killing her father gave her an edge. Ehiwa, what is the solution as it stands now? Do you know what to do? What is my fate in future? I do not know. I see nothing. Hate. Confess immediately. Where is Princess Zita? My, my, your Majesty, she's in her chambers. I am giving you before the sun set. Search for it. Call the princess. Are you can please. Zite, you are expected to clear these acres of land in the next four market days, after which another portion will be assigned to you. Guards, give her the market. Father, believe me, I don't know where it is. I don't know. The seer cannot lie. For the fact that you've been pointed out means you have something to do with the disappearance of the staff. Get to work. You will continue with this work until you confess. Let's go. So, Father, how do we get rid of that maiden? Our focus should be on how to get back the symbol of authority. The star. Are you telling me it's not a setup? Have I taken any decision in this palace without letting you know? Father, are you carving me out of your plan? When I know that Zite was framed. Son, trust your father. Could a you have you right? These questions are too difficult, even for the cause.
great seer of our kingdom. The one who sees the past, present and the future. What is going on? They have been shaved out of the fatal surface. Tell me what I need to know. You speak in riddles. I do not understand you and my father anymore. I need to know the truth. What truth do you seek? I thought the missing staff was a frame up. How come my father is becoming more serious about its disappearance? This is not a frame up. The staff is actually missing. Even you? Oh, come off it, Great Seer. My father told me about his plans towards setting Zete up. This is not about the plan. I suspect that someone is playing a foul play. Do not suspect, Great Seer. For you should be able to ascertain correctly. Now tell me, is Zite really a prime suspect? Drums and melodies of the spirit can only be understood by those who are connected with the spirit. Courage tends not to tamper with death. The tiger tends to attack the lamb because she is gentle and her shepherd has strayed away. But her life is left in the hands of the gods to decide her fate. Save your greetings. I am giving you two days to provide the staff. Else, I'll kill you with my bare hands. My prince, how else do I prove my innocence? I have spoken. Two days. My prince, my prince. Siti, did you actually do it? Shut up. Sister, listen. I feel your pain. I said, shut up. Listen, I do not want what befell Omar to befall you. What do you know about Omar's disappearance? Nothing. <laughs> what do you know? Father, you know I'm your son, the hair apparent of this kingdom. Even the blind knows that. So why am I being sidelined from the affairs of this kingdom? Who said so? The fact remains that the truth shall surely show itself. I know the affairs in this kingdom is negligence. This bit is something I have to think about. Your Majesty, some people are here to see you. 
from the marks on them, they must have come from a distant land. <clears throat> okay, let them in. All right, Chief Majesty. Are you expecting anyone? No, Father. I hope it's not a setup. A trick. Let's go to the city. Thank you, Your Majesty. God. God. Your Majesty, my name is Agu of the Wulu Kingdom. I am a merchant. I deal in slaves. I have come to ask for and seek your permission and to know if you have any slave for sale. Well, we don't have slaves. The sons and daughters of this kingdom are legitimate and hard-working people. Yes, we have a slave for sale. Oh, <laughs> that's good. She can serve you on every aspect you want. Yes. Oh, really? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Well, well, then let us see her. Let's see her. Okay, uh, she's on the farmland. Let me send for her. God! Imagine. Ah, oh. go to the farmland and ask Zite to come. Your Majesty, yes. this one you have mentioned so many good qualities about her. I hope she wouldn't be too expensive. No, not at all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she can go for free. <laughs> ah, really? <laughs> Your Majesty, you sent for me? Yes. Guard, take the cutlass from her. Come, in, sir. Greetings. Greetings. <laughs> um, your master, the king has sold you to me, so you now belong to me. Your Majesty, I do not understand. Ago, you see, we are nice to her. That, that is why she does not want to leave the palace. Hmm? But please, take care of her when you get to your kingdom. Oh, please, Your Majesty, what is going on? Young woman, I do not want to forcefully take you away from here. But let me assure you that whatever it is you think you are enjoying here 
you will enjoy twice in my palace. Father, why? Why? Did she say father? You see, when the man is too good to a slave, she turns his name from master to father. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> uh, Your Majesty, thank you very much. <laughs> Peace. It's all right. Uh, God. What's my name? Uh, Your Majesty. <coughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. I shall be on my way. Okay. Thank you. God, come and take her and let's be on our way. Yes. Wait! I will go. But let me have a moment. can heave a sigh of relief. <laughs> so, Father, how do we find the staff? Um, as long as Ehiwa is around, she is going to help us in getting the staff. Mm. <laughs> hey. Hey. Ehiwa, now we have finally Goffin read of her. What is the next step in recovering my staff? Hmm. I see the staff in this kingdom. But I can't fix exactly where. In canality, I suggest you get a fake one until the original one blessed by the gods is found. How is it possible? It is possible. Let no one hear that the king is ruling without the original staff of authority. It is possible. Hmm. That sounds better. At least for a while. <laughs> Something just came across my mind. Could it be the gods have taken it? No. The gods have nothing to do with this. Nothing. Where are you taking me to? 
I am taking you to the land of good things. You mean he bought me as a slave? Yes. And why do you ask? I'm your slave. Yet I'm not in chains like every other master due to their slaves. Well, that is the difference between a good master and a bad man. If truly you are a good master, like you portray, you shouldn't have been acquiring slaves. No. Oh. That's because I have a large area of land that requires labor. But in my kingdom, there is no difference between a slave and a free bond. Everyone has equal rights. Let's go. You are indeed a good man. And you are very courageous. Courage is a virtue every true woman of our kingdom must possess. And um, what kingdom is that? The same kingdom you brought me from. I know that if I didn't get you out of that place, that prison called Palace, you would have been dead by now because they wanted you dead at all costs. I know that I've been hated in the palace, but not to the extent of wanting me dead. You, do, you take everything for granted because you have a pure heart. But your God is with you. So I suggested to him to come and buy your own. As a slave, so that you can come here and serve as a slave and be alive. Yes. You mean you were involved in this? I planned everything. Ago is a nice man. He doesn't buy slave because he's a cool man. Just that he has large farmlands. As big as our kingdom put together. So he cannot farm on the land all alone. So he needs hands. That's why he came, he took us as slaves. So how do you come across a man like this? <sighs> when I failed to poison him, as ordered by King. Mm -hmm. So I had to flee for my dear life. To so where? If I may ask. See there I don't know. As we're about escaping, the guards caught me and my daughter. But our good deed saved us. They helped us to escape. As we're wandering in the forest, some warriors accosted us. or not, our instruction is to kill whosoever from Anjari Kingdom. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Stop, please! <laughs> 
Don't play a finger at them. Who are you to counter the order and tradition of our kingdom? What's tradition? Order! A tradition that is full of hatred. I. A ghoul of the Wulu kingdom. Command you not to lay a hand at them. Now! You will lose my rod! Your other ends immediately step your feet out of your kingdom. Warrior! Attack! Thank you very much. Thank you. How do we repay you for this kindness? You will be my slaves. No, how else can we repay you from being your slave? I don't want to be your slave. Yes. It is better to be a slave than to die a wandering. We accept. Dad, get their bag. We came here. He's indeed a nice man. Sure, he is. He never forces anyone to work. When she or he is sick, but some servant take it for granted. So, does he know I'm a princess? Of course not. The secret of your royalty will remain with me till the end. <laughs> The silver sword. I miss the glaring, sparkling look. Why don't you forget about that? I face the future and focus on how to achieve it. Which is motherhood, of course. Greetings, my lord. Greetings. Is it a... I woke up this morning to see a sparkling compound and then I overheard the voice of your cutlass who bring battle with the firewood. I hope you slept all night. Yes, I did. But a long sleep is for an endless life. Really? <laughs> That's good. Um, let me ask you, where would you like to work? In my farmland or you want to do house chores? House chores belong to women. I don't count myself as one. Well. Really? <laughs> That's good. Um, see, I am sure the king of your former kingdom lost a treasure in you. <laughs> a priest has no value in his land. 
Beautiful. Beautiful. So when shall I resume? Immediately. No. Of course. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. But I must cancel you. Hmm? Take it easy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Greetings, my lord. Greetings. You're welcome back. Greetings. Yes. Uh, not just back. Hmm? But I came back with butterflies on my belly. Let me get you something. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, just oh. use this to hold yourself. <laughs> <laughs> May I know the reason for your happiness? Mm. Me? Mm. How? For including Zita in my family. Oh, may the gods be praised. <laughs> you see, she is such a strong girl. Hmm? The gods should have made her a man. She has always wished for that. Mm. Mm -hmm. Anyway. I will give you a reward for bringing this happiness into my house. Thank you, my lord. Thank you for acknowledging that. <laughs> Let me get you water. Yes, bring it to my chamber. <laughs> They are so unique. They just concluded their Ofala festival. I think we should embark this into our kingdom. My daughter. Father. Every kingdom have their own culture and tradition. I want you to know that there are other kingdoms too that want to imbibe our culture into their own. Right? But father, their dance steps could be emulated. Mm. Mm. That's true. After all, we share common history of backgrounds. It's okay. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. We need to get home in time. It's getting late. Hi! It's a thing of shame. In fact, shame on me that I am I am here, still struggling on my own portion when you're done with yours. It's not a shame. It's not. Though we are human, but our strength and determinations are not the same. I am a man, not in this case. Zite. Please, I would appreciate if you could show me a little secret. <laughs> Please. There is no better secret than your heart. Make up your mind and you will be better. Suffer your body and it will surely, surely bring out the best in you. Thank you so much. 
Thank you, I appreciate it. Let me go back to my work. Yeah. What is going on? Yeah. I hear the sound. Yeah. What sound? Siti! Siti! Where are you going to? Become so weak that you now breathe toothless dark to defend yourself. I will not repeat myself again. Stay away from them. Oh. Two rounds cannot drink from the same bar. Else they will stop coming. Get her! Your Majesty, go in peace. Lady, who are you? Who am I is not important, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, she is the last slave bought by Adu Master. She's from Ajari Kingdom. And her name is Siti. Let me in my palace and leave me in the house for a word. Thank you, Majesty. Thank you. Do you know it has never been heard that a single warrior of Ada is killed in this land? It has never happened. Hey, they keep killing our people and always going scot free. We did well. The gods have set aside a day like this. Oh yeah. So let's get back to work. Okay. Greetings, my lord. Keepers of our kingdom. To what do I owe these visits? These items? And he ask us to leave these items with you.
when the ego leaves its chick in the nest for a journey, her return must definitely come with good tidings. That scene in my household, but the tidings of the soil, it's still unknown. A little flash of light that dropped in your household has given the kingdom a great furnace. And what is the light, if I may ask? That girl, that slip girl you bought, saved my life and that of my entourage while we were coming from the Fala Festival at Tobago. The demons from Ada attacked us. I mean, those demons that have made life difficult for us. But this maiden appeared from nowhere. We stood them and defeated them. When I inquired, I was told that uh, she's one of the last slaves that you bought. Though I lost two of my guards, but she broke a record that has never existed in this kingdom. Which is, if I may ask, she dropped the blood of the warriors of Ada on our soil. She killed them. I have many slaves working for me. Which one of them? I was told the last amongst them that you bought from Aja. Her courage is barely found amongst men. She has the heart of a lioness. Could it be Zite? Yes, that's the name I was told. Zite. Hmm. Zite. I called you here to tell you that what happened today should not repeat itself again. Zite. This is your chance of winning the king's heart. Come, you should know that you're such a lucky maiden. No one in this kingdom has been able to do what you have done. You don't know. Ha! What do you mean by winning the king's heart? Did I tell you that I was looking for a man to marry? Uh, that is not what I mean, no. It's not what I meant. What I'm saying is this. The king may find favor in you. Uh, yes, now, which may result into a royal gift and care. By the way, if I say the king's heart, I am not mistaken. Shut up! I, will, I, will, I, will. I said shut up. If I ever hear this again from you or from somewhere else, she won't like me. What's all this? Can't you keep quiet? I'm keeping quiet. Can't you keep quiet? I'm keeping quiet. What's all this? I won't say a word. After you won't say a word and you will know, say you know a word. Say something. Look at your mouth. You won't say a word. Don't, don't, don't mention a word though. Don't, don't, I don't want to hear it somewhere else. Let me hear you speak. Greetings. Greetings, my lord. What's going on? Nothing, see my lord. I am just coming from the king's palace. After receiving the gifts of your good deeds. <sighs> Why give Kola knots that is meant for an elder to a child like me? A little stone thrown at the beehive 
might seem to scare them away, but they most certainly will trace the stone to the hands of the thrower. You could have gotten yourself killed. I am so sorry, my lord. I'm sorry. And if anything goes wrong, all fingers will point at you. Because the warriors will most certainly come back in rage and anger. We may not see the sunlight again. You know why? No. Because you have done what no man has been able to do. I never knew it would get to this point. I was only trying to save the innocents and the weak. The king might seem to have found favor with you, for now. But the table will most certainly turn against you for igniting a war. A war? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my lord. What have I done? I don't know. I... Get up. You did what you have to do. Sorry. Whatever does not kill you would only make you stronger. Get up. I am so ashamed of myself. How do I advert this? How do I advert it? all alone this early in the morning. What has made the sharp speaking and courageous sparrow go so quiet? Mother, yes? I'm afraid. Afraid of what? Any normal being that did what you did will walk the surface of this earth with shoulders raised high up. Why is your own tilted at once? Mother, she will not understand. I'm afraid of the rain that will come after the saturated cloud. Rain has covered eyes, trapped the body of the lioness. Bravery does not tend to swallow a needle because of its tiny size. I have overstepped. No, you didn't. You did what every normal human being we did. You did everything you did to save lives. I wish I could sacrifice my life to advance this. Everyone seems excited about it. But only few know the consequences, mother. It's all right. I wish I could trade places with you and be well loved. But I don't ever sound like that. We love you. Don't we love her? There is no greater love than the love of a mother. Abomination. Abomination! 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 Finger has been poked into my eyes. The people of Ewulu has written a history that can only be erased by wiping out the entire kingdoms to create the history back to them. Yeah. It is true that we have been used to create history. How then do we wipe away the entire kingdom? How? How dare you speak? A 
as if you are afraid of the little puppies of a willow. Far from it. You are getting me wrong. I, Obum, dread not the puppies of a willow. What I'm trying to say is, for the fact that the warriors of Ekulu dropped three of our men, it's an indication that what we used to know about them has changed. Abum is right. I suggest we sell some new spice to see the new developments. That is true. We need an eye. Yeah. <laughs> Think about it. You've spoken well. Abum, Joku, the ball is in your court. I'll go. Your Majesty, you sent for me. I'll go. You are the only one of this kingdom. You are rich, and there is nothing any man born of a woman can offer you that will be new to you. <laughs> May the gods be praised, Your Majesty. All praises to the gods. But, um, Your Majesty, <laughs> why these praises? Our kingdom has lost respect. We are now treated like we have no value. Your Majesty, you know that if it is anything that money can buy, I will do it. I still need you to bring back that glory. The glory of... <laughs> Your Majesty, I... Uh, I am not a warrior. Uh, I am not also... the chief priest. <laughs> uh, it, it's beyond me. It's beyond my past. I know. But something tells me that you have what it takes to make every man in this kingdom walk free without fear of attacks attacks from the enemies your majesty you are confusing me the more that girl you have given the crocodile a meat so soft to chew but difficult to swallow that was why I asked what should be given to replace the lost jewel. She is priceless, Your Majesty. Or the team of warriors needs her. Just use it to hold yourself before your food is ready. I am not hungry. What happened? A few minutes ago you said we were very hungry. Why the sudden change of mind? Lion of our time, what troubles you? The treasure you gave me is about to slip from my hands. How do you mean, my lord? His Majesty the King wants Zeta in the lineup of the warriors. What? 
How? She's a mere maiden. Is it just because she offered to help? My lord. My lord, I beg you. Please do not let them take her. Do not oblige him. I did not. I asked him to give me a little time to think about it. My lord, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Can I go to eat? No, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. Where are the rest? Are they back? Yes, my lord, they are back. Very well. Father, now that we have a new staff, how do we make it a secret forever? It is safe. What is safe? The secret, of course. You mean it's safe between you and I? <laughs> I don't understand. Father, the lesser the people that knows about it, the better for us. What? What are you suggesting we eliminate Ehiwa? Now you're talking, Father. I don't trust her one bit. Look, the moment she suspects that the missing staff was within the kingdom and she couldn't fish it out, that was when I believed she cannot be trusted. Are you in any way suspecting that she knows the whereabout of the staff exactly my point hmm. indeed you have a point Is she? She is nowhere to be found. She must have run away. Remember, she's a seer. What then do we tell the king? Why are you being bothered about what to tell him? When he already knows that Ehiwa is a seer. A goat does not eat a man's yam when he's awake. She has already seen us even before we came here. Let's leave immediately. So what is your response to the kingdom's demand? Your majesty, this is a decision. Difficult even for the gods. Agu, the cave you fear to enter lies the treasure you seek. Make your decision to save us all. Lest we become like chaff 
blown away by the wind. Be ye man. Your Majesty, I am only a mortal blessed by the gods. You can have her. And your prize? Nothing, Your Majesty. Nothing. For she is priceless. I don't know how to repay you for this. You don't have to, Your Majesty. It is for a common good. But it is also important that we find out what her own decisions may be. Mm. That's all right. trap caught the antelope as expected. It got what we never expected. My lord, I would have wished you pressed further. I may not stand to see her risk her life at her journey. I did. But she has her decisions to make. My lord, I know Ziti. She loves war. And she will always oblige. A man is not fit to live until he has a purpose to his life. Maybe it is my destiny. My lord, tell the king that I'm ready to finish what I have started. My child, what have I done? I should have allowed you to stay back at our diary. Fear not, mother. For fear kills faster than despair. Be courageous. Okay, my child. You are only a woman. A woman that has a future. You will raise family someday. My dear, war is for men and not for women like us. Just look at your mother. Mother, allow the gods to decide my fate. My mother told me that you've made yourself available for sacrifice. How do you mean? That you've been chosen to be amongst the warriors of this kingdom. Yes. Uwe, you should listen to my mother. She has a point. Or do you want to die at your prime? The visitor, death, comes knocking when it's your time. No matter your age, it's meant for everyone. Do not pull the bee high when it's not time. But I ignited it. Fresh buffaloes are meant for the strongest pride in the lion's word. You need to stand by your arrow. I will miss you. I will really miss you. Me too. I'll miss you too. Come here. Mm. Elder Safaza. And our warriors, you all are here to witness the inclusion of a fearless lioness into the team of warriors. Zite. Your Majesty. By the powers vested in me, I hereby include you into the team of warriors of this kingdom. Thank you, Your Majesty. Ulari, Your Majesty, give her 
a sword of beauty. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. I really want to appreciate you for finding me worthy of being among the warrior of the Wulu Kingdom. May you live long, Your Majesty. You see, and I will not fail to recognize he who made this inclusion possible. He is Ago, the right hand of the king. May the gods reward you. You see. All right, listen up, everybody. We are taking the sleep pot. Okay? Let me show you an example. Okay? Yes. When I say go, not now. When I say go, you take your fighting position. And this way, this way. Okay? Yeah! 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 All right, at the count of four, you take it. One! Yeah! yeah. Two! Yeah! Three! Yeah! Then backwards. One! Yeah! yeah. Two! Yeah! yeah. Movement but a different court. We call it Roundhouse Court. This is okay. Watch me. Yeah! Cock very well. Okay? Yeah! 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 At the count of four, you repeat after me. Okay? One, two, three, four. Let's go! Yeah! Two, yeah, three, yeah, four, yeah, backward now, one, yeah, two, yeah, three, yeah, four, yeah, come forward now, one, yeah, two, yeah, three, yeah, backward now, one, yeah, two, yeah, three. Yeah! Four! Yeah! Four.
why are you sneaking up on me? I am sorry. Although I'm the chief warrior, but I think I have a lot to learn from you. I mean, after today's training section, you still have the strength to train more. To flow in the crowd is to be lost. Be different and learn more. And that is why I'm here. Tell me about you. Nothing other than an orphan that was sold into slavery. Mm. I see. Well, I'm impressed by your moves. And I must say that I envy you. Sowing prepares you for harvest. <laughs> to be strong, you must have gone through a lot in life. How did you lose your parents? I do not know. All I know is that I'm an island, surrounded by the only source of joy, a tree. Oma, she is like a mother to me. Oh, I see. Good one. Can I have a word with you? Sit. Thank you, my lord. I am listening. Omar. My lord. A man cannot have a goat in the house and complains of lack of meat. Our people say that it is only a uh, a foolish farmer that allows the best of his crops to be choked by weed. My lord, have I or my daughter done something wrong? No. Never. I want you to know that you are a treasure to be cherished. My heart beats for you. My lord, Please lay your linens open so that they may be understood by the rays of the sun. Oma. My Lord. Henceforth, you cease to be a slave in this household. Thank you, my Lord. You are what I have sought for all these years. I want you to be my wife. My lord. What would you do with an old heir? Whom have seen so many moons pass by. Maidens who are capable to do what a man like you needs are all over the place. I am rather too old for you. Mama, do not say you are old for me. Do not consider yourself barren. Because procreation is not the only reason for the union between a man and a woman. What do you think I can offer you? Love. Companionship. Affection, wise counsel, like the good meals you prepare every day. My Lord, give me time to think about it. I might take all the time you want. Until the sun falls from the sky, I am hopeful that one day you would say 
Yes. <laughs> Can I cry the dishes now? I believe we all owe. What's going on inside you? Since this fool came here, Ulari has shifted his attention to her. <laughs> when you get a new fish, you throw away the old one. That seems to be the condition here, but she will never succeed. <laughs> we all look but see differently. The meeting seems to need something more than love. Something like what? She's keen about defending our kingdom. I think your man is trailed by the skills of the young maiden. That better not be. Nothing cripples a maiden like jealousy. It is a step to witchcraft. Who is jealous? I'm only concerned about my heart. <laughs> Your heart that never knew you exist. Don't worry. With time, he'll get the message. Zizi! It was mother. Mm. Yes, I will meet her. Hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh, mother said you should come here. Is anything all right? Mm. She said she wants to tell us about a proposal and to seek her consent. A good one, I guess. Mm. I think so. Okay. You know what? I will go with you at once. But first, let me bid my co warriors goodbye. Okay. Let me just wait for you. Okay? Oja! Who? Now, wait you. Hear me out. My lord, why do you cast your net in the shallow water where there is nothing to catch? Oma. My lord. No matter how blind a man might be, his walking stick would never lead him astray. My lord, I'm scared. I'm confused. I don't even know what to say to you. Oma, you don't have to be. You don't have to be. Please. Please. Just. Just say yes. 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 I say yes to you. Of 
animal have you eaten its heart that gave you the courage to be farming on my land? I might be expected to be soft, but not as soft as a ripe banana. Else, you will trample on me to pieces. Enough is enough. Oh, Idu, I have seen you grow wings. It's all right. As a leader, you are expected to be transparent. But, Idu, I will deal with you. you that is a promise. Let's go that. I you want to see what you're made of. You can't I will deal with you. You can't do anything. I promise you that. Come okay, here. let's let's get to see. Uh, let's see. So who owns the land? Your Majesty, before my father died, he told me that Idu's father was going in. So you decided to take the land in place of the debt? Yes, Your Majesty. Idu, what do you have to say over his claims? What well, give Your Majesty? It is not true. My father never told me of any debt. I am not spirit. I will let the gods decide who owns the land. Thank you, Your Majesty. Gods, Your Majesty, go inside and get me two cutlasses. Right, Your Majesty. your knees. I pray to the gods that today we mark the end of the land dispute between you both. Rise. But your majesty. Fight yourselves. Whoever wins is whom the gods have chosen to be the owner of the land you are fighting for. Your majesty, please, you have to settle amicably. Gods, your majesty, kill them both if they refuse to fight after the count of three. One. Congratulations. Is my judgment not fair enough? <laughs> fair enough, Your Majesty. Fair enough. Fair enough. Take this mess away from here. The land is now yours. Nothing without control. Strength does not lie in it. Victory is best celebrated after the battle than during the battle. Free your heart, they will be sure of the direction of your enemy soul. to welcome everyone of you to today's training. I believe and I know that you've been doing fine. 
or today we are taking it further. What did I say? We are taking it further. We shall be combining the four courts that we've been learning all this week. Is clear? Yes! I'll watch the first move. Your distance. Come back, okay? We shall be doing it three times. Let's go. Ready, stance. One. Yeah! Back. Two. Yeah! Back. Stars. All right, we shall be advancing to the enemy. We're taking the war to the enemies. Is that clear? Yes. Watch me. You already stands. Unlock all the durations. We all look but see differently. Sight is a function of the eyes. My vision is a fiction of the mind. Vision renews your mind to so clearly hit a target. You need to be calm, like sea waters, and be focused. She's all over him again. I feel like strangling that maiden to death. That same opportunity came during the training. But what happened? To be confronted is not the problem. The problem is allowing yourself to be on the ground forever. <laughs> Let that maiden from Ajari be. No matter how much you train, you can never be a match to her. Oh, oh come off it. Just because she created a record that no one has done doesn't make her God's over us. Odo, to be thoughtless is to be useless. We all dread the warriors of Ada, but this maiden did the unthinkable. I'm not comfortable here. Without sight, you will not be able to live too quickly. 
For he who lives too late will be punished by life. You speak with so much wisdom. Wisdom is a luxury everyone must possess, no matter what. I told you this girl has evil intention. She wants to kill you. I told you. How did you do that? Speed, sight, and vision. The tiger is designed to kill by these three laws. For speed and ambush is a great attribute of a good hunter. It's either take you away or unaware. One of them is kicked. Obum, what is it? Where is Jaku? Jaku is dead. Whoa! This gun. He was killed by a medium warrior when sneaking. Whoa! Shit! A woman who bent down to the village sniffed life out of my warrior? Hmm! Suspected this medic to be the same person that killed the other day because I overheard them saying. Oka has become so weak that he has to bring someone to protect him. The woman for that matter, he has to bring someone from a jury to protect him. Oh, 
Works majestically because it feels that no other animal is bigger than it, not knowing that the size of the lion can challenge its size. This is one thing training a monster because someday he will turn against his master. Ehiwa has decided to shed her old skin. I told my father, I told him, that a day like this we come. Send this message to your father. I see calamity. I see calamity befalling this kingdom. If you do not change from your way of life. What your people need is love, care, and uprightness. Your words are sweet as wine, but lack substance. My people are not complaining. On whose side are you? We are on the side of the truth. Nothing but the truth. I think we should cut down on how we operate in this kingdom. Yet your heart is full of smiles. To the wise, deepest court should be coated with smile, no matter how deep the court is. Mm. I admire your courage. Rivers, mountains, and wilderness we go through in life, you say, despite the smile. Thank you for saving my life, Jada Deep. The river does not flow through the forest to bring down trees. Rather, it gives life. You are welcome. Do you know, I really need to learn a lot from you. It is so shocking that it's only the egrets that knows the lifestyle and the secret of the cattle. Then I would wait and learn like the egrets. You're welcome. Shall, so, shall we? we? Yeah. Let's try. May the gods forgive my atrocities. May they have compassion on me. Yes, I'm in support of my fathers taking over the throne, eliminating enemies, but my father's act has gone beyond the unimaginable killing, the innocence, which is not linked to the throne pursuit. May the gods forgive me.
Where is my father coming from? He blood stained on the sword. My prince, we overheard the former having an agreement with his wife over infidelity issues. The king heard the noise and ordered us to go inside the hut. And the kill is kill Ufoma's wife. What? Not again. This can't be happening. Can't be happening. Father, why? Why what? Why did you kill Akudi, whose marriage is barely three full moon? And when has the son of a lion suddenly turned into rooster? When a lion shakes off his king, he never had. Who amongst the gods stabbed him in the back? The story of your deed. Is written on the knife, Father. When has blood suddenly grown mad to speak? I repeat, who among the gods told the prince that the blood is a goddess? I did, Your Majesty. <laughs> I did. I did, Your Majesty. You see? Kill them all. Kill all your guards and remain unprotected. All of you, leave my presence. Now! Now! Leave! I really envy you. Why if I did ask you? Because so many trees have been waiting to be planted by our master, Ago. But he never picked any. What are you talking about? That you are lucky to be our master's stepdaughter. I enjoyed myself so much yesterday. And I ate like no man's business. Hmm, me too. I really do. Your mother is lucky. You know, the memory is always lingered. And marriage is once in a lifetime. Hmm. You're lucky. Your mother is very lucky. Ah! Ah! Ew. What is it? Let me make use of the bush, eh? I'm very pressed. Ah. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. So much food for yesterday's marriage. Gracious morning, Your Majesty. Greetings, Your Majesty. Where is my son? Prince? Your Majesty. He went out, but he will soon be back. Father! Father! What happened to my father? What happened to him? Take him to his chapel. 
glorious of other kingdom. As in the kingdom, we test our roach tomorrow morning. That wicked king. That wicked king is going to pay dearly for killing my parents on their way back from the market. Hmm. I want to slit his throat with my sword. I want to test his blood. Hmm. Do not worry. We are going to set that kingdom ablaze. Yes. We will ravage their women and watch them mourn. I make sure I subject his son to slits and shred. Then he will have a test of it. We are going to cut him alive and watch him have a test of his own blood. We we'll bring doom to the kingdom. I promise that. I get the kingdom! I get the kingdom! Receive your doom! Although, you have really improved greatly, and I'm impressed. All thanks to Ziti. Mm. Indeed. Friendship is like a tie that binds like a knot in dogs, which gives room for improvements in whatever you do. <laughs> Our ties have really improved a lot in me, Ziti. Mm. Of course. Shoot, 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 shoot. Wait, wait. What is this? Aja, what is this? What is this? What is this? My princess. What happened? It was at the farm. Then I became dressed. And I went into the forest to ease myself. What happened? I went down into the forest to ease myself. On my way coming back. I overheard the warriors of Ada saying they will make our kingdom a history by tomorrow morning. What? That's none of our business. She's now a bona fide indigen of Ewili Kingdom. Oja, it's okay. Please go back to mother. But do not allow her to know about this. Okay? And be careful. You too. Be careful. Be careful. What are you going to do? I need to go back to my people and save them. Same people that sold you out to slavery? In life, you don't pay evil with evil. Replace evil deeds with good and allow the conscience break the guilty. So, who is the presence in our midst? that we knew not. So many things are hidden in a river cave. Brighten your lantern. Not today.
Hope he will be well. Everything lies in the hands of the gods. Although I shall return tomorrow, but his temperature is very high. All right then. Make sure you do your best. Okay. Go. Thank you, thanks. My prince, to what do I owe this surprise? Long live my prince. Speak. The quick that will sink our kingdom is on his way. The warriors of Ada are moving faster towards our kingdom in anger. Organize yourselves, or I shall be with you at the camp. Your Highness. Gods! Gods! The war, you can't go alone. The enemy of your enemy is your friend. I do not want you to get involved in what you do not know. Allow me to go alone. What goes around comes around. When they are finished with Ajari, they will definitely turn to us. So, let's finish it up at once. Great warrior, please permit us to go.
so funny that the most dreaded lion is running away from trouble. Who, who fights and runs away lives to fight another day. I never knew that running is a virtue of a fierce fighter like you. Unfortunately, you run into nowhere. The nightmare of every kingdom ends today. I am not the last nightmare you will encounter. Show me the demon and I will crush him wherever he is. The demon lies right there in your palace. Your father. Brother, do not allow this fall brainwash you. No matter how wild a dog is, it can at least be tamed. But you are a bow we never knew till the days of our ancestors up till now. Yeah. Ah. Oh. No. Back to my kingdom. Don't go. You belong here. I want to be happy alongside with my mother, Oma. I'm the girl I call my sister, Oja. They need me. If Oma is still alive, let her come with you too. E, confess now, or the, the gods will force you to. I ordered for Omar's head because she refused to kill Ziti. I killed my other brother because of the impossibility of ascending the throne. I killed your mother when I found out that she was pregnant and she was to give birth to a baby boy who will ascend to the throne of Ajay. Ziti. Is there anything you have to tell us? Yes. Speak. Adigwe. Adigwe. What is this? Keep it safe. Go, of 
our ancestors. Why should you hand over the ancestral symbol of authority of this kingdom, which is the life of this kingdom, to me? Why? Because I perceive you are the most upright man in this kingdom. You still have not answered my question. It is very risky. I know. But the circumstances surrounding my parents' death is questionable. Uh, are you insinuating that he is responsible for the death of your father? Keep it safe until I find the truth. What if a what traces this authority to my house? She knows. She knows? Keep it safe. Meaning that the king has been ruling his people without a symbol of authority. Yes. With fake symbol of authority. Zita, the head to the throne of this kingdom. As the law we have it, that whoever is killed forcefully, Adigwe, all the power bestowed on me. As the mouthpiece of this kingdom, Neil, I call Zita. As the ruler of Ajari Kingdom. And this is the staff of office, the great symbol of authority. to appreciate my mother, Lord Agu and Igwe Okaka, who saw potential in me. Thank you so much once again for choosing me to be your leader. I promise from this day forward, this kingdom shall experience a new beginning, a new era of peace. Oh, yeah, your majesty. By the gods we trust. Brother, please don't go. I'm no more relevant here. I'm ashamed of myself, particularly my attitude towards you. In your eyes, I see genuine repentance. Please, brother, come with me. Let us take this kingdom to a greater height. You shall take over Ada and be the leader. And together, we shall take this kingdom to a greater height. Please, brother, 
Come with me. I hail thee, your majesty. Thank you. Dreams. That's true, a dream. You were never.